Okay, I've just set the KWA up, zeroed at 10 meters. This is the sort of distance a lot of people use because it's basically the length of their back gardens. But what you tend to find at 10 meters is that anything longer than that, the BB will sail really high straight over the target. So we'll just take some shots at 10 meters and then I'll do 20, 30, 40, and show you where the BBs fly. Okay, let's get on with it. So that's a 10 meter zero. Next we'll push out to 20 meters. So the wind's taking them already, but what we're not looking at is the horizontal deviation, we're looking at the vertical deviation or elevation. Um, and you can see, even at 20 meters, which is only 10 meters more than the 10 meter zero, the BBs are already somewhere between six inches and a foot above the aim point of the scope. Okay, on to 30. And the same again at 30 meters. In fact, the deviation's even more. So if you're aiming at a relatively small target, it'd be super easy to miss at 30 meters with a 10 meter zero. And then finally push out to 40 to 45 meters. And even at 40 meters, the BBs, or the majority of the BBs, are still hitting high. So 10 meters probably isn't the best solution for an airsoft zero. Okay, now we're going to shoot at the 20 meter target, and then again I'll shoot at the 10, 30, and 40 meter targets and show you where the BBs land. <laughs> 20 meter target, and we can hold off a bit because of the wind. But again, we're not looking at the horizontal windage, we're looking at the elevation changes. So that's 20 meters, pretty much in the center of the reticule, and now we'll shoot at 10. And they're shooting easily six inches low, even at 10 meters, which is quite, quite a lot of change. Okay, so on to 30. So at 30 meters, we're somewhere between on or about six to eight inches high. So if we remember, we're six inches low at 10, on at 20, pretty much high at 30, and then moving on to 40. So even at 40 with a 20 meter zero, the BBs are consistently on about level or up to about a foot high. So again, you could easily miss a target at 40 meters. Okay, so now we're at 30 meters zero. Again, I'll take a few shots at 30 and then I'll do 10, 20 and push it back out to 40 meters again. Okay, so that's 30 meters. Now we'll go to 10. So you can see how much lower we are at 10. Again, a good six to nine inches. 20 meters. Again, low at 20, not quite so bad though. And all the way up to 40. And low at 40. But if you hold sort of head neck junction, they'll drop in about mid chest, which is about right really. So now I've zeroed at 40, so we're going to have a nice go at the 40 and then again 10, 20, 30 and see what the holdovers are. So 40 meters. Okay. 10 meters. Low at 10, but potentially a little bit less than before. 20 meters. So they're, they're a little bit low, but they're also comfortably inside the reticule on this Vortex scope. 
So it should make actually make taking shots quite easy. 30 meters. So the tendency is for them to move a little bit higher at 30, but again they're inside the reticule, which will make taking a shot easy. And we'll go back to 40 for the last couple. And they're all nicely inside the reticule as well. So for this KWA gun, uh, using 0.28 ASG Devil Blasters, a 40 meter zero seems to be about the best choice. It means I can pretty much place the reticule of this scope on the target's chest and they're going to safely hit somewhere with inside that reticule at 10, 20, 30, 40, potentially even 50 metres without having to adjust my holdovers. So today we had a good look at the effect that a different distance zero has on where the BBs land on your target. So if you zero at 10, 20, 30, 40 or 50 metres, the BBs at different distances will land at different points and it's well worth knowing where those are. Thanks for watching. I've been Tom Anvil Hibbard at Thurston Air Gun and Archery Centre. Please like, subscribe, ding that bell and we'll see you next time. Hi. Hi, welcome back to... Welcome back to Got The Giggles. So today we had a good look at the effect that a different zero has. I can't even talk anymore. <laughs>